The East Syracuse Free Library regularly hosts blood drives, and they have a donor who is a regular. News Channel Lines, Iris St. Moran introduces us to Bob Barnes, who's taken his message of the importance of blood donations on the road. Bob Barnes loves an adventure, and for his most recent biking adventure, he decided to visit every state capital and promote blood donations along the way. That's the common denominator between all of us. Whether you're Elon Musk standing there and I'm here, we have the same blood and I can help you and you can help me. Um, so, that, and it kind of brings us together. He started August 1st, 2021, and 359 days and more than 16,000 miles later, he completed his journey. And yes, I did fly to Hawaii with my bicycle and that's how I got to Hawaii. He did encounter some challenges along the way. There were some bad things. I burned down my tent. Uh, that was unfortunate. I lost a lot of my gear and my tent. Um, luckily, my followers helped me out and donated to my GoFundMe at the time. But that did not stop him. He averaged about 47 miles every single day. He's back home now in what he calls his home field, the East Syracuse Free Library. They regularly hold blood drives here, including this one. Barnes was not able to donate because his temperature was higher than what was allowed. But his blood type is very fitting for challenges like this. Be positive, just like my attitude. Yeah, I love it. Yeah. He'll be back to donating soon. Every 56 days or whenever they have the, the blood drive. Not mm. only is he helping to spread the word about the importance of blood donations, by making regular donations, he saved countless lives across the country and right here. I just feel like it's the right thing to do. I feel like it's our obligation. Uh, if, you're a lot, if you're able to, because not everybody's able to donate blood for health reasons or one reason or another, and that's fine. But if, you, if you're able to, we should all get out there and help each other. It's one of the best donations you can make. In East Syracuse, Iris St. Moran, News Channel 9. The East Syracuse Free Library will have another blood drive May 8th. We'll provide a link to the Red Cross so you can find a donation site that might be more convenient for you.